about this mine end again. Um, the beacon over there, which I've been on, of course, and I've been all in out the woods over there now, and uh, along the coastal path, which I did in September, after I camped at um, Porlock. Uh, a nice campsite there. Reasonably priced, very cosy, nice, quiet. I've just come down a track there where there's a horse, a lovely black horse. Didn't take any notice of me, it was busy eating. There's a lot of grass where there's no snow at the moment. They're making the most of it, fattening themselves up for the, when the winter comes. Because remember, this is it's still autumn. People think it's winter now because people put their central heating on so early. It's alright if you've got it. I haven't got central heating. I don't, I don't really like central heating. To, in a way, I don't actually like it. It makes you too hot. But it's a lovely valley. Now this valley, this comb here is Bitcanola Coombe, which I came up in the summer in a very, very hot day. I came up that. After going to video the church, I did a swoop round and I went down, I went down Weecom Coombe, which is the other side of that one, went to the village, went to the shop, went to the church, then oh, came up this long, just met two people who've just made it to the top now, they're doing very well actually, and uh, I just zoomed in on that horse again. He didn't put his head up. He had lovely, lovely legs, lovely, lovely black coat and lovely white ankles. He looks brown. When you get up close to him, he's actually black. It's very deceiving. Beacon's right over there now, Beacon Hill. Um, Wells, Port Talbot over there with the big tall chimney that pollutes the air with yellow smoke. Um, over in Wells, there's Port Talbot there. Um, the Bristol Channel leading out to the Atlantic Ocean. There's a liner actually going on, making its way out. And these lovely gnarled trees are getting, also getting ready for the winter, aren't you? I don't know if you're dead or alive, you can never tell with these. Dead or alive. <laughs> I'm just doing a bit of exploring, a bit of weaving towards, um, there's places on this hill of ancient significance, apparently. Barrows and round circles and stuff, apparently. Probably see it better from the other hill. But, uh, and uh, I'm going over towards a, a copse that I've seen loads of times. I've never bothered to go over towards it. I don't even know if I'll end up there yet. God, look at that sheep. He looks like he's got an artificial coat on. Look, looks like it's just been plonked on his back and sewn into place, doesn't it? He's got a lovely coat underneath. Looks really tatty. Yeah. Hello. Hello, sheepies. Oh, it's beautiful, isn't it? So much peace when I'm here. So beautiful. Right then, on top of a hill now, there's um, Dalbra Hill Fort, not far from Holford. There's Hinkley Point. We've got all the combs now going down back to Holford there. The Beacon Hill over there with Tolbert, Port Tolbert with its tower in the distance in Wells. Minehead over there. Dungry Beacon right up the top there, big peak. There's that wood I've just come from down there. And I passed some horses. I haven't seen the news today. I've got no idea about any news to tell you. Um, only about Prince Andrew trying to get out of a sex scandal. Um, deny any had um, relations with a 17 year old and all that, you know. 
But uh, it's all awesome. somebody's making money out of all that, no? Basically. I'm trying to look out for the coom I've got to go down at the moment. I might have missed it. I might have to go back. I'm not sure yet. I'm not sure. I'll tell when I'm down here, down here a bit which comb I'm supposed to be doing. Um, let me just zoom in over there. I see something white. So I've seen deer down there the other week. No, it's just trees, tree bark. Yeah, I'm not quite sure. I think lower hair nap is the other side of this hill. I think that's where I have to turn off. So I'm not doing, um, I'm not doing, um, Shepherd's Coombe and Ladies Edge area. Um, I'm not doing Slaughterhouse Coombe. So I'll be doing, I got, I hope it's that one. I got a feeling it is the other side of this hill over the tip there. Uh, lower hair nap, yeah, no, in yet. No, because higher net hair nap's right over there. Then you've got the the beacon further up on the top there, Black Hill, with a beacon up there. Out the top there. That's Black Hill. And there's a beacon, there it is. Or is that a bloke? That's a person, but there is a beacon somewhere. Some more ponies. Somewhere as well, I've just seen them. Oh, it looks like Blaze Spaghetti Junction down there, doesn't it? All those carvings into the soil there. Because we do get um, mountain bikers out here now, carving it all up. Now, there there used to be brown cows around here. I think they might be horses. Yeah, they're horses. Yeah, but I haven't seen much of them this year at all. They reckon a lot of farmers are going to stop doing cows because of the environment and the climate and all that, and methane gas. And unless they can find a different way of dealing with that. They want people to almost become vegetarian. I don't eat it. I mean, I've known you for years that beef don't agree with me. I've known it for a long time. I love it. I love a fat, big, juicy steak. But gives me gut sake for months. Alright then, I'm going to turn off for a minute. I don't see no deer. I don't think. I just have a little zoom down over there a minute. I thought I saw something, but then sometimes it's just a, a bush changing colour like that. that. I don't know. Look. Oh no, look. There's a stag. I can see a stag. Oh, he's having a rut with another one. God, my arm's aching. It's awkward having to hold the charger at the same time. God, I'm surprised he hasn't been pursued, but they might have been after another one. He's boldly walking over there, isn't he? With his does, his family. Probably the ones I've seen the other week, actually. It's the same hill. <sighs> so easy to lose it. I get it and then I forget where they are. There they are. Well, I'll do. I'll take some photos, I think. Overnight.